Hello friends, let us learn about acid fast staining. Acid fast staining is a differential staining and thus was first developed by Seal and later on was modified by Nielsen. So, this method is called Seal Nielsen staining technique. The main aim of this staining is to differentiate a bacteria into two categories that is acid fast group and a known acid fast group. So this technique was used for the bacteria which cannot be stained by gram staining, particularly those of the genus Mycobacterium. They can only be visualized using the acid fast staining. So now let us discuss the principle of acid fast staining. Mycobacterium is the only species that is known to be stained using acid fast staining. And this is because of a special characteristic present in the cell wall. That is, the cell wall is rich in lipids and also has a presence of mycolic acids. And due to these presence, they remain impermeable to most of the basic dyes. Whereas, if the dye has a presence of phenol, they are permeable. So, a dye present with a phenol is permeable. So, we choose a carbon fission. These dyes are having a presence of phenol in them. And once the bacteria is being stained with a carbon fission, it cannot be colorized with an acid organic solvent. That is, with an acid alcohol, it cannot be decolorized. And hence, these bacteria are called acid fast bacteria. This diagram is a mycobacterium tuberculosis. This is the structure of mycobacterium tuberculosis, that is, TB. As we discussed earlier, mycobacteriums are the only bacterium that can stain with acid fast staining. And this is due to the presence of mycolic acid and a rich lipid cell wall. So, due to the special characteristic of this cell wall, that is a waxy cell wall, they stain bright red with the acid fast staining. Now, let us discuss the procedure of acid fast staining. First, we have to prepare a bacterial smear on a clean slide. Next, we should allow it to air dry and later heat fix. The next step in acid fast staining is to cover the smear with carbon fusion and then heat the stain until vapor begins to rise. That is, to a temperature 60 degrees Celsius, the stain is being heated. We have to make sure that overheating is not done to the stain. The heated stain should remain in the slide for about 5 minutes. Next, wash it with a clean water. That is, the stain has to be removed. Later, use an acid alcohol for about 5 minutes until the smear is completely decolorized. Again, wash well with clean water. Now, cover the smear with methylene blue and this stain should remain in the slide for 1 to 2 minutes. Wash the stain with clean water. Now, wipe the back side of the slide so that the slide is clean. Now examine the smear under a microscope under a 100x oil immersion. Now let us discuss the summary of acid fast staining. Acid fast staining uses three reagents that is carbon fission. This is the primary dye and both the acid fast as well as no acid fast bacteria take up red color. Next is acid alcohol. Acid alcohol is used as a decolorizer and for acid fast bacteria it takes red color 
whereas the known acid fast loses the red color that is the bacterium now is colorless next is methylene blue methylene blue is the counter stain used in acid fast staining and for acid fast these are red colors and the known as fast bacteriums are blue in color so the reason known in acid fast staining is carboxylation acid alcohol and methylene blue now let us discuss the interpretation of acid fast stain the acid fast bacteria are bright red in color whereas the known acid fast stain bacteriums are blue in color in this diagram the a shows the known acid fast bacterium whereas b shows the acid fast bacterium that is the acid fast bacteria are red stained whereas the known acid fast bacteria are blue stained Now let us discuss the examples of acid fast staining. The acid fast bacterium are mycobacterium species. For example, mycobacterium tuberculosis. The known mycobacterium species are known acid fast bacteria. Next, let us summarize the steps of acid fast staining. First is application of carbon fission. that is the primary stain later is the application of heat that is the stain is being heated third is the application of acid alcohol this step is the decolorizing step fourth is the application of methylene blue that is the counter stain after this procedure is over we observe the slide under a microscope so the acid fast bacteriums are red in color the as the known acid fast bacteriums are blue in color this is because in the decolorization step they have lost the color and they take up the methylene blue color so hence the no known acid fast bacterials are blue in color hope you understood the concept of acid fast staining For more such videos, do subscribe to our channel. If you like the video, please like as well as share with your friends.